Hey, my name's Sav, and welcome to part four of my Hellblade Senua's Story playthrough. Uh, I didn't say it properly, so I've had to come back to this point, which is a little bit annoying, but that's fine. I'd also, also like to start this game by doing a special shout out to Skull Train Gaming. Mm. Thanks for being my biggest fan. Okay. So I've had to go and do this right, whole find the raven thing again because I didn't say. Really frustrating. Whatever. Here we are. Let's go. We're off to find Valraven. Oh, hi, mate. Let's do a quick little look around as we wander in. It's all very spooky looking. Not ominous at all. Ah, a Trixie buddy. Oh good, more ravens! <laughs> I'm guessing we're gonna have some kind of battle here because this looks like an arena of death! Let's go and try the door, shall we? Thank you for your vote of confidence. I've got we both saw lives. We can fight it together. Alrighty, Roo. Please stop with the lights. My computer can't handle it. <laughs> At least I have this whole door portal thing worked out. Oh. Really? That's I have to get up there. Okay, cool. Yeah, at least this whole door portal thing. It's been sorted out now, instead of wandering around for hours, wondering what the fuck it is we're meant to be doing. Why? Why do this? Why? Give me a ramp! Oh! Ramp! To nowhere! Brutal. Where is the door that I have to wander through? To see stuff that is not seen right now. I'm a really good songwriter, just in case you weren't aware. I'm gonna get frustrated. Clamber. God damn it! Where's the spooky doorway? If we can find the spooky doorway, then we can go through. Oh la la la. There's a spooky door up there. Okay, how do we get to it? It's one spooky door. Any more spooky doors? I think that's the only spooky door available. So we will try to get to this spooky door. Any other stairs? Hmm. Trying to hide the way with a log. See what's going on here. Could you <laughs> climb? Ladder? Hello. You're drinking coffee today. Spooky door. Spooky door friend. You are friendly. My spooky door friend. I don't. Speak to me, Drew. Tell me the story. Yeah. So. Oh. Listen. I will tell you the tale of a man called Findon. Findon. The Northmen had captured Findon's sister, and his father sent him to pay for her release. But they took him to <coughs> put him in chains. And held him for a day and a night till I do the water. Mm, that doesn't sound fun. Then they released him. I don't know why. Upon his return, his father's enemies in Erin set fire to his home. His father burnt to death. 
his brother was killed. And he escaped in his sorrow. Oh, joy. His father's enemies offered redress for his loss and invited him to a feast. It was at a hall near the sea. But when he went there, they betrayed him to the Northmen, who enslaved him and took him to hell. Six years later, his slave masters landed on the shores of Orkney, burned all before them. And into that fire, Fyndon made his escape. What was Fyndon? burnt away that day, and from the flames, a new man stepped forward, and Drew was born. Drew, the man that I am now. And though Findon never set eyes on his dear sister again, I Are we late? Getting crabby. Uh, I love that this game or this playthrough is a lot of me just not knowing where to go. Oh, it wasn't helpful. Thank you, though. Okay. Did that help? No. Right. Okay. So I feel like this is going to be a lot of me wandering around looking for stuff, so I'll come back when I have found the passage. And I'm infinitely more irritated. Okay, so I think I found it. Our, um, that beam ramp thing that I keep trying to climb up looks like it's got something next to it. So we're going to go try that. And hope for the best. Oh. Cool, off we go. Let's go! Go on an adventure <laughs> up to the ramp. They won't let us walk over it. Let me up. Hey, it's a good news day, everyone. Everyone, we did it. Stoked about that. Oh, more beams. I've been been here before. Would have been better had I not stumbled over my words, but that's all you're getting, so. Bloody enjoy it. Now what? What do I clamber down? Do I have to jump? Can I jump? Use this? Is this it? Oh. Press F. That's it. Just press F. She's so particular about the things she will jump down and the things she will not jump down. Very frustrating. Hey guys, it's going well. I'm feeling good. All right, up we go. Anyone noticing the glitch in her neck just now? Just me. Oh my god! Oh my god! We're gonna die. It's fine. No, oh my god! 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 Okay, it's fine. Guys, hold on to your hat. There's, not, there's nothing to worry about here. I'm. Ah! I've got this. I'm not stressed, you're stressed. Okay. Hey, Burbs. We're in a nest. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Rabbits. The gate is open. It's open. It's darkness. I know it from the wilds. It's coming back for me. Oh, spoops in the background. No. I don't know. 
saw you at the map. I remember. It didn't end well in the wilds. It never does. You think you can overcome the darkness? Make sense of it. And once relief settles in, Throwing you helplessly back into the maelstrom. Drowning the mind in fear. Deeper. Deeper. Driving you down so far into the void that maybe this time there is no coming back. What is going on with her convulsing? In the darkness. Sense. She remembered what he told her. Hear me. Reach out to me. Reach out to her face. Take my iron mirror. Look into it. For it is a window into the underworld. Within, you will see the face of the darkness that you fear. It looks and like something's feeding off her with the way her body's like moving. I taught you to. Uh. You'll also see that as much as the darkness has you trapped within its veil, it too is trapped within yours. Focus. Focus. Focus! Get it! Get it! You won't get it! I see you! I see you now! Oh. You led me to the wilds! You trapped me there! We're about to go down. It's about to get down. So we've had a few technical difficulties so far with this one, as you are probably aware. The uh, quality, sound quality of my voice has gotten a lot better. Uh, I didn't have my mic my microphone on for the better part of this video, and didn't realize until well a while ago. Anyway, uh, yeah. So for some reason, I have uh, my start recording, stop recording, hotkey to space. Space is spacebar is the same key for dodge. So going into this fight, every time I dodged, it would stop and start recording. So there's like millisecond recordings that I now have to delete all off my camera, computer, whatever. There's that. Uh, and I have done this fight like seven times now. I can't do anything. She won't fucking move. What am I supposed to fucking do? <sighs> so I'm over it. I want it to be done. I'm hoping this is the last time that we have to do this. Fucking hit him! Hit him, Senua! He's a fucking asshole! <laughs> we did it! We got it! The mark of Valraven. One of the keys to the gate to Helheim. Hold it in your mind's eye. With every battle, the darkness grows stronger. Every victory bringing her closer to defeat. Unfair, isn't it? In those dark winter nights in the wilds, there were times when she considered letting go. If it weren't for truth, a chance encounter in the wilds, she would not have heard his stories of the Northmen. She would not have this chance to find Dillian's soul. I'm coming. I'm still here.
Cool. So I'm going to leave that there. I am very flustered. Uh, yeah, I was at that particular fight attempt for 20 minutes. I'm very over this game at the moment, like, for this session. So if you stuck around for all of that, thank you so much for watching. I am trying to make these shorter so they're, you know, easier to consume. Anyway, thanks. I'll see you next time.